From August 1st to November 3rd, I logged 18 sails on the San Francisco Bay. The iconic landscape would become very familiar to me, but every day, the winds, tidal currents, fog, boat traffic, and wildlife present new surprises, new challenges, and ever-changing scenic delights. I've been fortunate to experience sailing on many different boats and make new friends with fellow dreamers along the way. In September, I earned my ASA 103 Basic Coastal Cruising Certification and skipper to sail for the very first time. My skill and confidence on the water and my love of sailing grow with each and every sail. In spite of some of the losses I experienced this year, this has to be one of the happiest, richest times of my life. My dream of making sailing my way of life is becoming a reality, and I'm so thankful to all the people who are helping me make it happen. Trying to catch the wind, it's dirty. Trying to catch the dirty wind. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh my gosh. Yeah, no clean air. Look here. at all that you've been missing sailing with us all this time. Yeah, you guys are fun. The other guys had to stack back. It's a big boat. Sometimes when the wind is light, the most interesting thing happening on the bay are the other boats. And sometimes a strong wind of 20 knots or more against a swift ebb tide makes for exciting and splashy sailing.
The bay's famous fog is both dangerous and magical. Your heightened alertness for boat traffic hidden in the fog also opens your senses to appreciate its eerie beauty. and sailing with the breathtaking sunsets, each a unique work of art. I feel as if the boat and I have been painted into the masterpiece, and the masterpiece has been painted into me. And suddenly, along came the Connie, a 1980 Catalina 38, an unexpected opportunity that would change my plans and broaden my sailing horizons more quickly than I could have imagined. Yet to take the next step, I still had a lot of saying goodbye and letting go to do. I gave most of my possessions to close family for safekeeping. It was hard to watch it go, but I knew what I was trading it for. A new life, a new adventure, a new chapter that I am completely free to write however I want. And for now, this chapter is about life aboard a sailboat, sailing into new territories, and urban stealth camping four nights a week in my Honda Element Ember. Um, this is a big leap for me. Um, complete drastic change of lifestyle. Mm -hmm.